Okay, I'm just about finished with the um, EPO Skywalker. I'm going to do a quick video of where I'm at so far. Uh, this is, I think, video number four in the series. This is not going to be very long because I haven't done a whole lot to it. Basically, I got the wings finished, taped up. I got the servos installed and connected via a Y harness so I can install a gyro on the ailerons. Um, everything came out okay here. The only thing I'm not satisfied with on the wing is um, the servos I'm using are these Tower Pro MG90S, uh, I think they are, MG90S Metal Gear 9 gram servos. And they work really well, they got rave reviews, uh, but they're extremely noisy. Uh, so I'm not real crazy about the noise, but they'll have to work out. The fuselage is done with the exception of my Velcro for the batteries. Inside is pretty empty. Nothing in there except my 72 megahertz Corona receiver. I'm not going to use any electronics, any OSD, FPV, or anything like that. For the maiden flight. One thing that I'm a little bit concerned about is my antenna for the 72 megahertz. It runs out of the hatch through that tube and basically out the tail of the airplane. The thing I'm concerned about is mostly flying this airplane away from me and back towards me. The antenna orientation I think is going to be uh, the the least optimized so I'm thinking about possibly running it out the wing that may be better but if anybody's got any ideas about that please let me know I uh, strengthened up the horizontal stabilizer with some carbon fiber spars and that made that horizontal stabilizer much much more sturdy but the tail boom is pretty flexible when I rock the plane back and forth or shake it I get some tail wiggle there, or quite a bit of tail wiggle. You know, if I do that, I get some tail wiggle. So uh, I'm looking for some suggestions to strengthen that tail boom up a good bit, so I don't see so much of that wiggle. Um, same Tower Pro Metal Gear 90S servos in the elevator and the rudder. Again, they work well. They're extremely noisy, so they'll have to do for now. I may change them out if it really gets on my nerves, but it really doesn't because I only hear them when I'm on the ground. Once I throw the plane in the air, um, I won't notice that. My uh, video camera may record that, but uh, other than that, shouldn't be too bad. So yeah, anyway, the uh, maiden flight hopefully is going to be Saturday morning here, and hopefully by Saturday afternoon I'll have a maiden video, and um, my thoughts about how this plane flies, and hopefully it will look like it does now.